loves, long time no see. You are actually seeing me in my Ross form. I just got the two little ones off to school and I have no makeup on. I haven't been wearing makeup as much as I would like to, so that's changing. As I told you guys, I'm starting a whole new transformation. I'm doing my hair care, skin care, just overall health and body. I, I'll i be turning 33 in May and I do have some health issues in terms of high cholesterol and so forth. And I've realized that with five kids it's so imperative that I'm able to keep up with them and that I'm around for them. And so with that said I have decided if I'm not going to take care of myself, no one else is going to take care of me. And I take care of myself in terms of doing what I love. And that is spending time with the family, crafting, and all that other fun stuff. And I'm very, very lucky to have such an amazing support system. And all of you amazing people on YouTube have made it possible for me just to keep pushing forward and not being afraid of what needs to be done and just going for it and so for the next I'm either gonna do it I'm trying to do it for 90 days but that'll um, surpass my birthday period and I have to admit the past few days I've been slacking and so I am starting it clear straight up starting it tomorrow and I know I said that before but it's just it's so imperative that I get it started now I was my plan was to start it on the first, and then the first kind of got away from me. And so, because I've been getting so much stuff together, I have tons of makeup that I've been downsizing, and I haven't even downsized half of it yet. So, you know, I'm slowly realizing, and it, during this next six weeks, it's going to help me to realize what makeups I actually use and what I don't use, and, you know so forth. So definitely check out, if you haven't already, the sales. I've posted several videos of different makeups and stuff I'm selling. And um, all prices are negotiable. Sorry about that. And um, so let me just get right to it. I have a box right here of all of the stuff that I intend to use over the next few weeks for um, my personal care. I'm going to set this, yeah, I got a package. No, I still got a package. So I'm setting this box up here right now, and I'm going to slowly pull things out of it and show you. But I'm going to get close up so don't, like, freak out to show you guys what my skin actually looks like at this point. And I'm hoping by the end of the 90 days, if I stick to what I'm, I want to do, which is downsizing in my soda consumption which I only drink Sprite and on occasion I'll have a Dr. Pepper but still I want to downsize on that my biggest weakness is my coffee and my husband is so sweet because he always 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 tries to make me a Starbucks coffee in the morning whether it's Starbucks or you know whatever and um, my wonderful wonderful friend Marissa Creative to Mommy, I think is on, her name is on here. I'll put it in the description below. But I was blessed to be able to hang out with her for about a week's period of time in California back in February. And she sent me home with this amazing coffee from Hawaii. And I'm almost out of it. So if any of you guys uh, watch me and you're from Hawaii um, and you want to do a swap or you'll... I can PayPal you to send me that coffee. I would love it. So just if you're um, if you live in Hawaii and you're willing to pick up an, a particular coffee for me, email me and my email and stuff will be in the description below. And yeah, we'll figure something out because I'm like needing that coffee. And I know that sounds bad, but yeah, that's my biggest weakness is my coffee. So. With that said, let me get close so you can see what my skin looks like because I am not pleased with my skin right now. Um, no criticism because, yeah, I do need to wax my eyebrows again. But I do have my own um, eyebrow wax kit here at home, so that's what I use. I don't actually go to the salons anymore. So, here we go. 
as you can see, I have, I don't know, I think my skin is terrible. So that's what my skin looks like up close. Okay, so first and foremost, let me show you what my intentions are going to be for my skincare. I was blessed by my hubby, I think a year ago, he bought me the Clarisonic Plus. Okay, I'm not going to lie, I'm not going to sugarcoat it. I don't use it on a daily basis like I should, so that's going to change. My intention is to use this bad boy first thing in the morning and every evening before I go to bed. And every week I will do an update video for you guys showing you the transformation of my skin using this. So, this is one thing I'm going to be using. I am also going to be using the Jan Marini uh, Bioglycolic Facial Cleanser. Now, I'm only going to use this three times a week. Okay? So there's that. In terms of facial wash, I'm going to go back to basics and I'm going to be using the Cetaphil. I actually have to go pick it up. I'm either going to use the Cetaphil or... I'm not sure yet. That's the only hiccup I have right now is which facial wash I want to use on a daily basis that isn't going to dry out my skin because I do have combination skin. So with that said, you know, you get, most of you already know that, but for me, I, I tend to get oily in my T-zone and the rest of my skin tends to dry out on me and it's really, really frustrating because as a lady who wants your skin all dry and flaky, because when that, when that happens, a lot of the times when your skin dries out and gets flaky, it's very difficult to apply makeup because you see all of the little ridges in your skin. And who wants that? I know for sure. I don't. So, as my moisturizer, I will be using my Jan Marini. I love this stuff. Spring and winter, uh, summer are right around the corner, and this does have SPF 30 in it, so I'm all for it. I have I have this bottle, and I have another one that I did a swap with somebody. So once it's out, if I discover that this truly, truly does perfect my skin the way I want it to, I'm going to go ahead and take the dive and purchase it. Okay. I'm also going to be using Witch Hazel. Now I did show you ladies that you can purchase this Witch Hazel at the Dollar Tree. I have the full bottle. I prefer this one. The Dollar Tree one is just as good. Um, but I like this one. I like that I can determine <laughs> where I'm at and if I need to go get more. That's the main reason I like this one. It is a little bit pricier. I got this at Target. I think I paid $3 for this. So it's not bad. But if you're on a budget and you don't want to use all your money in one shot, definitely go to the Dollar Tree and pick up some Witch Hazel and see if you like it. If you don't like it, then there's no point in spending the extra money to get the larger bottle. Now, what I intend to do is I will use the regular one in the evening where I just put this on a cotton, which let me show you. Sorry about that. Just a regular cotton swab. Sorry about the lighting. I am in my bedroom right now. I have to figure out where I want to film my videos because I have a mirror behind me, and so I would literally have to drape something over it so you don't see the entire room. But, um, so yeah, or I'll just have my hubby put up a sheet and, I, you know, something. I'll figure something out for you ladies, though, for all my um, future tutorials. So, with that said, I, I use this and this together. And I'm going to show you what I'm talking about. It's, you know, you don't think that your skin gets dirty overnight. Oh, let me tell you. It does. Let me take this off. I just picked this up, so 
And I did get the one from the Dollar Tree that I showed in my um, haul video, which I will be posting. I did a Dollar Tree haul for you ladies, which I will be posting today. So I don't know which video you'll see first. So you just squeeze some on here, and then you just go over your skin. Now, I want to keep you aware that this stuff stinks. So if you're um, very meticulous to smells, I don't recommend it. It is amazing for the skin. I also go down to my neck. And look, just overnight. I used to not think that that could happen, but now I know it does. Uh... Well, I've known for quite some time, but when I first started, I didn't realize that while you're sleeping, your skin can get all dirty and yicky. And so my biggest downfall is I don't take care of my skin like I should. And so that's something that's going to change, and you will see that during the transformation. Just realizing it really looks like I don't have eyebrows, but I do, you guys. <laughs> um, so I'll be using the Witch Hazel for the next six weeks. And I'm also going to pour some of this into another bottle. And I'm going to, just a small bottle, ladies, that has like, where you can get it at the Dollar Tree, has a little squeeze top, and I'm going to put 10 tablets of aspirin in it, and then fill it with this. The aspirin will dissolve from the witch hazel, and you mix it up, and then before you apply your makeup, you can use it as a toner, because that's what I use it for. And this does say that it's for face and body, gently relief for oily, irritated, red, damaged, blemished, or inflamed skin. So, and it works great as a toner. In the back it says that it's dermatologist recommended, 100% natural, contains no artificial fragrances or dyes, cleans deep down to your pores. So that's why I will be using this. So, but... With the aspirin one, I will also do the same thing where I just take a cotton swab and I put it over my face and then, there goes Spike, and then when it dries, you'll see like the little aspirin particles on your face. Spirit fingers! No, I'm just kidding. You'll see the little aspirin particles on your face. So what you'll do is you'll just take a clean brush and brush it off and then apply your makeup like you normally would. So that's one of the things I'm going to be doing. For body wash and whatnot, I'm just going to be using the Soap and Glory Body Wash with Antioxidant Grape Seed Oil and MSUDS Moisture System. Now, this is the last bottle I have, and I realize they don't sell more any, uh, yeah. Soap and Glory anymore. So, I just wanted to try it out, see how it works, if it helps with my skin, and then, of course, I will be using my Clarisonic as well. Okay. Then, for my eye makeup remover, I will be using Albaline. I love this stuff. It takes the makeup right off. It doesn't clog my pores. It's just amazing. And I noticed that I, um, I use this for Jossie's eczema, the whole nine yards. And it works amazing. So, there's that. And what I like about this also is... I'll, of course, I'll go more into depth down the road as I, you know, if you guys want to see more detailed information on the products. But I will be using the Albaline. And what I like is that it moisturizes your lashes. And that's a lot, you know, a misconception is, oh, I don't, I have sparse, you know, eyelashes. The thing is, if you moisturize your eyelashes every evening before you go to bed, it prevents it from breaking. Because your lashes do change up every six weeks they fall out and so forth so you want to keep them moisturized so I'll be using that I am on a whole new kick for my nails now so I will be using my nail tech and I'll let you guys know how it works I haven't used it before so my nails are a hot mess right now so I want to see what the transformation of that does I will also, with the summer, be using my MAC Fix Plus. And I will also be using this when I apply my makeup. For my... Um, like I said, I'm going to be doing these for at least six weeks. 
I will be using the e.l.f. Mineral Primer. And I'm only sticking to e.l.f. because I want to let you guys know how it works after six weeks. Spike's getting in trouble. Now for my eyes, because you know once you get to my age, you got to moisturize. <laughs> um, I'm going to be using the L'Oreal Advanced Revitalift. And this is AM and PM. So this is what I will be using. I am going to use, this was, I'm not going to lie, this was sent to me by a company, and it's long overdue. I have not used it. And so it's time that I actually try it out for the next at least six weeks, and it is the Naturalux Lash MD Eyelash Formula. So I will be taking pictures today. Woo! And I will be using this every single day. And I will take pictures every week to see if it truly does transform my lashes. So I'm going to get close and show you my lashes at this point. As you can see, there's really nothing to them. So um, I want to see if that is going to lengthen them and how that works. If that doesn't work, I'm going to try another one. I'm going to try a drugstore one. And I will let you ladies know which one I prefer better because I will try this one out for the first six weeks and then I will try a drugstore one out the next six weeks and see which one I find better results with. Okay. For my hair, I'm not going to lie. I don't use any... My hair is very, very long. If you can see. I've got jammies on. It goes almost to my butt. So... With that said, um, if you guys watched my previous videos before, you will know that I cut my hair exceptionally short back in May, and this is how much has grown. So, for my hair care, I am going to be using this Eden Allure Organic Moroccan Argan Oil. Okay, a little goes a long way with this. Basically, let me show you one two pumps and I use two because my hair is so so long and you just run it through and you can already see that it gives it a shine I don't know if you guys can see that I love it but I noticed that my hair is starting to dry out and I'm not happy with that so I have been debating I obviously want to grow it a couple more inches. I'm going to trim it up and I will be doing using the Crea Clip if I can find where my little princess put it. And I will cut my hair this weekend just a little bit, but I want to show you guys how the Crea Clip works. So I will do a before picture and an after picture and I will share that with you guys. And of course I will be taking plenty of pictures over the course of this transformation. I'm also going to be using the Hannah Shine Shield. And this is what I'll use before I heat, you know, put any heat treatment to my hair. So there's that. And I did want to share with you guys this. It's the Lash Serum by L'Oreal. If you want to try this out, instead of what I am going to be testing, definitely pick it up. It's... A cheaper alternative I will be testing this out this is the one I was telling you guys about that I will test out after I'm done with the name brand one because I do I definitely want to see if it's worth investing in the name brand one for you guys so there's that I am also going to be using this I picked this up at my local Dollar Tree it's the five this is the wrong one no this is it the Natural White 5 Minute Whitening System. Now I'm not going to lie, I can't stand having this stuff in my mouth for 5 minutes. So what I do, because I'm, you know, I tend to want to spit and you can't spit with this thing. It's like, ugh. So what I do is I brush my teeth, pop this in my mouth, and then jump in the shower. Because I could spit in the shower and, you know, if I have to. So definitely using this and I got this at my local Dollar Tree so I believe I have another one I don't know where my kids put it 
but I will be, if I can find it, it's brand new, I will do a little mini giveaway for you guys. As for my toothpaste, this is a new one that came out. It says that it's the same white ing ingredients as the strips. So I figured, you know what, let me try it. It's the Colgate Optic White. I will let you guys know my teeth are far from being as white as I'd like them to be. So there's that. And lastly, I want to share with you guys the vitamins I'll be taking. I noticed that the Biotin 1000 MCG works amazing. This is sublingual, sublingual, a sublingual version will get to your body faster. So I have amazing results with this. I love it. You saw how much my hair has grown, but I'm probably going to pick up another one because I don't think I have enough for the next 90 days. No. So I'll, you know what? I'll probably stick to this and just go get another bottle. But keep in mind, you guys can get it from your local Walmart, but it won't be the sublingual version. I got this from a vitamin store. Okay. Of course, my husband, silly guy, wants me to take a one-a-day vitamin. So I just take the woman's active mind and body one a day for my vitamin. Okay. I have a hard time with my energy levels. And so my husband gives me this B12 complex. It says great tasting. Oh, no, 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 no. It's not great tasting. But it is an energy metabolism. And for this little bottle, you get 59 doses. And let me tell you, you really get your money's worth. And you get this, I think, like six bucks at Walmart. So let me show you. I love it. And it says that it's an energy metabolism. And I probably have already said that. It's fast acting. It does go under your tongue. It's a dropper, and you just leave it under your tongue for 30 seconds. I think that's the hardest part for me, um, so I do that. Now, I'm also, I'm not saying go out and get it. I'm just letting you know what I'm using for my weight loss journey is this Oxy Elite Pro. And for this, it says... You take one capsule on an empty stomach 15 to 30 minutes before breakfast for the first three days, and an additional one capsule may be taken five to six hours later on day four. So, no. I only take it once a day. I don't go more into it. And you get 90 capsules for this. I'm not going to sugarcoat it. This bad boy is expensive. I think I paid $50 for this. So if you guys got a better alternative, definitely use it. I'm just doing it because I noticed that it helps suppress my appetite and I don't get the munchies like I always do throughout the day when I don't take it. So that completes what I'm going to be using, what reviews I will be doing on the products over the next six to nine weeks. All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm so sorry this video is 24 minutes long. But if you have any questions, simply message me below and we will talk soon. Love you guys. Bye now.